So I'm supposed to be shooting like half the set. I was doing like a whole set last week. I had half the build, but I am not feeling very good. This is supposed to be the first shoot day. I just... Oh, I have another flare. Uh, my intestines it hurt terribly. So I haven't done anything today. <sighs> I can't afford to lose a day. Let alone any more days. Gotta get this done. I can't, but I can't do it when I'm feeling like this. It's just, I'm feeling just enough to where I, I feel lousy. So I'm just hoping the next couple days I can, I can feel better and catch up. We'll see. I don't know. Well, it's the day after, and last night was kind of rough. I was throwing up a little bit, I was in a lot of pain, so, and today I still feel kind of uh, tummy crappy, so, um, I don't know if I'm going to do any stop motion today either, we'll see. I'm probably going to do some stuff on my computer, because there's always stuff to do on my computer, but, um, I don't know, just... I feel like it's such a waste having like all the stuff that I have right, it's ready to go. Yeah, I'm just gonna get the characters on it and do stop motion, but I'm not gonna do something if I feel like I'm gonna have like gut pain and and or, and just not being able to do you know, complete everything. So I gotta wait. I am sure today I probably most likely rest a lot. Anyway. I guess you'd call it part of the process, I don't know. But we'll see what happens. Maybe if I rest good this morning, this afternoon, I might be able to do something. And then maybe if I feel good, you know, and sleep good tonight, maybe tomorrow I can start doing some stop motion. And let's catch, just catch up next week. So, we'll see. Okay, let's see what uh, Hi. Yeah, I'm not where I should be. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. I should be at home, doing my work. But for some reason, my gut decides to go crazy again. Something completely different is some floppy, floppy, flop. whatever. I'll explain it later. And we're heading off to the hospital. See what we can do to get this stuff taken care of, fixed. Some but probably gonna be a little longer than a two-day stay. Okay. We'll see what happens. The week starts right now. Kind of free here, and um, looks like I'm probably going home tomorrow, and give you all an update later. But I have a surprise. I got surprised tonight by someone special. And there she is. She just walked through the door here. I was sitting right there, and my mouth is like this. <laughs> Yeah. <clears throat> and that was so sweet. I tricked you. Yeah. I told you it was going to make her work. Yeah, she was like making, and I, and I, and I fell for a hook, hook, line, and sink, stinker too. It's like she was saying, oh yeah, I can't get out of work, oh I'm working so late, and I was feeling so bad for her. I'm like, oh my goodness, my <laughs> wife is working so hard. And turns out she was just trying to get here <laughs> to see me. Um, so yeah, I ordered my food. Even though I already had food, like, recently, but that's fine. I've been able to throw out tonight because I have work tonight. And so she's about to eat. I'm waiting for my food. And we're probably going to watch a movie or something, so. Hello, everyone. Just giving you a little bit of a rundown update of what's been happening during the hospital stay this week. I'm going into the hospital this week uh, for the little bit of complications, and I've never felt so embarrassed to walk into the ER and just be like, Okay, otherwise I just knew I had to go. I couldn't stop the inflammation from happening. And actually the blockage was a very minor blockage. The only 
real concern was the fact that one of my one a piece of my small intestine was overlapping itself and that could cause problems so you know I got admitted to the hospital but then it turned out okay it's not a big concern no big deal so that was fine and so I got admitted uh, that uh, during the weekend I I've been here for like let's see here uh, almost four days I think now was it some Monday Tuesday Wednesday yeah almost almost four days like three and a half days and I could have been out here two if they just would have started me eating right away it took them like a couple, like two days for me to start eating this is like oh, nuts it's like communication problems you know but as usual nursing staff was great you can never complain about them you know the food service was great and and yeah just love this hospital and, and what they do for the most part so and they're able to you know, keep me going so I guess um, the one thing as far as uh, my own um, personal work related uh, with Tales of Ahala, lost two weeks, unfortunately, but I did get all the audio that all the, all the, all the voiceovers that I've, we've, I've worked on with voice actors like the beginning of this year. I've reviewed everything, I had time to review everything, and so now it's all reviewed. Uh, I cut out audio the audio tracks that, you know, will could work with the scene and ready to lay down that track so I can begin cutting a full trailer. Besides that, we will get back to hopefully a regular schedule of events next week to where I just got to start the stop motion again and get rolling with that because it's still there. Got to do it. So anyway, um, this is me and oh yeah, uh, we're still, I'm still in my hospital room of course, but I am going home today. That'd be great. Go home, rest out for the weekend, and begin again next week. So I'll see all of you next week.